Hey everybody, I'm back y'all. I ain't been here in a few days. I know. It's my birthday, so I needed some some me time. <laughs> I forget about y'all though. We're gonna jump right into it. I'm gonna get a collective read, guys. So and happy birthday to my fellow Pisces. Alright, so let's see what's going on. Y'all don't mind these nails because I know they look crazy. I have to go get them done. I've been lollygagging around. But, yeah. Okay, let's get into it. Give me a collective read. What's going on with the collective? What's going on with the collective? All right. Some of y'all could be We got the Queen of Pentacles here at the bottom of the deck. So, some of y'all could be dealing with the Earth sign or you are Earth sign. Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. We got the 8 of Pentacles, 8 of Wands, 5 of Cups. Four of Cups, the Sun, and the Knight of Pentacles. Okay. I see y'all could be disappointed about something. Something didn't go. Um, it's not working, and you're kind of like having regrets, or you, or someone's not putting in the effort. And you could be having regrets, okay? So you could feel like someone here is being sneaky, okay? With that seven of swords energy, this could be you. Let's take this. Let's know that it's a collective read, so it can go vice versa, okay? This could be you or someone that you're dealing with or a situation that you're in or someone that's around you. Yeah, somebody's not reciprocating, and I see you being disappointed because it's like this person is not showing. They just look sad with the four of cups. It's just like some sad ass energy. I don't think this is you guys' energy. I think this could be someone that you're dealing with. Let's see. Yeah, the emperor. Some of y'all feel like you don't have control over a situation. No, I'm seeing father and kids. Okay, it could be a Libra. This masculine here could be a Libra. But I'm getting um, a father and kids. That's what it looks like. Tell me why the emperor is here. Yeah, ten of cups. So a masculine... I mean, I feel like your intuition is telling you that a masculine's attention is somewhere else, okay? Because we got the high priestess and the six of wands, all right? So, you've noticed that this person's attention has been elsewhere, possibly like on friends or going out, hanging out, drinking, partying, whatever the case may be, just being social. I feel like you're starting to take notice You see this person, realizing that this person not putting in any effort. Could be a Leo. Or Aries. It could be any sign. And I see you kind of like crying over spilled milk. You're starting to regret it. You're starting to have regrets. You're starting to regret putting in any effort into the situation. You feel like you should have waited. Okay, maybe you feel like you wasted time. Feel like it's a waste of time to even deal with because this person is a liar, they're sneaky. Yeah, at this point, you feel like you're forcing it, and, and that's something that you don't want to do. But I feel like you feel like this person should apologize to you. You're, going, you're trying to see if this person is going to apologize. And I see you trying to just figure things out for yourself. Like, which direction should I take when it comes to this situation? 
I see you trying to communicate with this person and give this person a chance to confess, come up and, you know, tell you uh, what's on their mind. Can be a king of pentacles. Um, Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. See, you feel like this person is in and out. Like, they're inconsistent. That's the problem. They're inconsistent. Your finances could be up and down or their finances could be up and down. But I'm getting, like, inconsistency. Okay? And the challenge is getting this person to open up and have and talk. Okay? So, this person may have shut down, um, shut down on you. I see you've been doing things to see if certain things are going to work. Um, I'm picking up Leo really, really heavy. But like you're spying on this person. You could be looking through this person, could have looked through this person's phone. But I see a lot of y'all like, you know what, let me just see, you know, just testing out little things to see if this works. Okay, is this going to work? Is this going to perk this person up? Is that, you know, like, because I'm just getting like, it's kind of stale. I'm getting like some stale energy here. Like, it's kind of like blah, blah energy. Yeah, but your intuition is real strong. Your intuition is real strong. You 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 know this person. Yeah, you know this your intuition telling that this person is lying, cheating, sneaking, that three of swords. You just feel it. And you just feel it. You know this person. I feel like you are deciding to change your mind. You're changing your mind and you're focusing on yourself. Because we got the moon in the will of fortune. So you know that this person is hiding something. And I feel like you're going to do what's best for you in this time. And you're going to think this through. You're going to think it through. Um, but I, I see some of y'all, like, you're over this the past. Like, you, you found a way to get over the past. You know, like, some of y'all may decide, like, look, I'm going to just put myself first. I want to have fun because we got this three of cups here. And I see you wanting to, it's like you're slowly, with that knight of pentacles, you're, like, kind of, like, slowly creeping your way out the door. I don't think it's something, like, that's quick, as quick. You're kind of, like, slowly, you know, creeping your way out. You're looking to have some fun with that three of cups, okay? Um... You know, you got a real serious decision that need to be made. And you feel like a lot of people could have told you that this could happen. I feel like you didn't see it because you love this person. You love the hell out of this person. We had the five of pentacles and the lovers. But with that justice here and the five of swords, that lets me know that there's a lot of issues that needs to be resolved. Okay. Now, with the Queen of Wands and the Ace of Wands, I'm getting, like, really? This person could be really have a high sex drive. Um, and you could be feeling that's why this person is walking away. Like, this person is always, like, just want to have sex all the time. Every time you think that this situation is moving forward, this person messes up. This person messes up. And you just want this person to start telling the truth. So you can kind of be a few steps ahead. But you feel like, you know, this is a lot. It's a lot going on. 
and you feel like you need to, you know, prepare. That's what I'm getting. Like, you feel like you need to prepare for this to end. You feel like an ending is coming because we got the death card there. But the thing that I like about the death card is that it's not like a total ending. It's an ending and a new beginning. Okay, so things that need an end, but it's there to help transform you. Help to make you a better person. So I feel like you're already kind of like preparing. You're kind of prepared or preparing yourself for this. This person over here is the full energy. This person over here is stressed out. They could be stressing out over finances with this nine of pentacles or they just want some um they're stressed out about like the future where things are going like they're it's like they're thinking about themselves okay because we got the nine of swords and the nine of pentacles they want the connection But there are things that need to be talking about that need to be talked about. Getting some of y'all could even stop having sex with this person just recently. Like, just you guys don't even, it ain't even getting popping. Yeah. I feel like you're upset because you feel like this person came in and gave hope. For this situation, like they came in and gave a lot of hope and made a lot of false promises. And this is something that you're thinking about. Like this is constantly on your mind, especially if there's children involved. Because I'm getting a father and children or a father and a child. Um, and I'm getting like giving hope to this situation and then run off. It's like that's that's the thing that's that's bothering you about the situation. Because this person is so inconsistent inconsistent. They're there one minute and then they're not. This person told you they were going to make some changes, that they change, but then they'll never do what they say. Like, they'll do it for a little while, and then they're, they're onto something else, or they get bored, or, and you, I feel like this is somebody that has done this with you quite a few times. It's not the first time. It's not the first time. That's what I'm getting. You know this person. All right, so that's the message that I got. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. I'm going to chat with y'all later. Yeah.